Good evening, Austin, Texas. What's up? This is Dave. I hope you like your black screen. Tonight, we're going to have a bunch of stuff like screw that I recorded at the uh, wonderful back room last night. There was uh, screw in the skate nigs. It was a beautiful show. Ankles, wrists, heads, knees, flying everywhere. It was a beautiful thing. So y'all check it out. We're going to play a lot of the uh, video from the show last night. I hope you were there. Uh, if you were at the show, give us a call at 478-9425 and uh, we'll talk on the air about what you thought about the show. I personally thought it was pretty darn good. Uh, we're going to go ahead and roll that video and uh, call up with your comments. Once again, 478-9425. Here they are. See ya.
That was Screw. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll be bringing you a little bit more of that later, of course, because I know you can't live without it. Some good stuff. We taped that live at the uh, back room last night. That was uh, quite a good good show, which of, uh, they have a lot coming up. So uh, y'all look in your, your uh, chronicle and figure out what the best show coming up at the back room is. And uh, there's a lot of good ones, a lot of good road shows. And uh, anyway, I'm Dave. Welcome to the show. As I was saying, we shot that last night at the back room. Um, we shot all of the screw set, and we'll be bringing you a little bit more of that later. Uh, we also shot the skate nig set, and that was with the beautiful Intelli beams and uh, the new lights and all that groovy stuff they got up there at the back room. And uh, let me just start the show by naming a bunch of good shows coming to town. Of course, Tuesday, you know, you got Soundgarden, Pearl Jam, and Swerve Driver at the City Coliseum. From what I hear, that's uh, sold out. So if you didn't get your tickets, hey, too bad. Uh, Thursday at the back room, they have a killer moss show. So you need to go check it out. Thursday is Dead Horse, Entombed, and Ex Exhorter, I believe. Something like that. Uh, here they're really good bands. I know Dead Horse rules. We got an Entombed video somewhere. Um, next Friday at Liberty Lunch, Blues Master, John Lee Hooker. Check him out. He's got a hot new album out. He'll be playing. Um, also that night, a lot of stuff going on next Friday night. Night Ranger, remember them? They're playing at Sneakers. Uh, and on the same night, Badlands is playing at the Back Room. I believe that's Jakey e. Lee's project. Lots of other good things coming to town. White Zombie at the Back Room. Blur at the Back Room. Geez, those guys got a corner on the market, don't they? Well, I guess they should with the cool place, man. Uh, man, lots of good things coming to town. There's not a night that you can't go out here in Austin and find some good stuff. Tomorrow night, as a matter of fact, at Steamboat, Joe Rockhead's playing. Uh, at Steamboat Monday, uh, if you like the Monday gig, you know, you got nothing better to do on a Monday because it's the start of the week. Maybe you got bummed out at work or something and you want to go let it all out. We'll go to the uh, Steamboat Monday night. The Austin Music and Entertainment magazine presents Hard Rock and Metal Mondays. Uh, it's going to be, I guess, headlined by Draconis, who, which were formerly Skullduggery. Uh, also, July Alley, who you can see on Capsize tomorrow night. Uh, Trauma and Mercury, a couple other new up up-and-coming bands here in Austin I've heard a little about. Mercury is supposed to be pretty hot. Um, run over a few more things with you and we'll go to the phone, man. Uh, we got Sneakers even has some good stuff coming up. Legs Diamond, April 30th. Zebra, June 10th. Man, Zebra. Y'all remember Zebra? I don't believe it. I didn't know they were still around. Hope it's the same guys because they used to be great. Uh, also, tomorrow night at, uh, where are we at here? I don't know. Can't tell. Looks like Mercado Caribe. Yeah, Mercado Caribe. Timbuk3. Uh, they're playing two shows, an early show at 7 and a late show at 10. Uh, so go catch Timbuk3. They're great. Or go catch Soul Hat at Antone's tomorrow night, man, Saturday night. What can you expect? Um, during the work week, another work week show, Wednesday at the Jelly Club. you got Rumble Night every Wednesday. This week it's going to be Rumble Train and Black Pearl. Uh, once again, tomorrow night, Two Nice Girls. Uh, that's at Liberty Lunch. They're a good band. Go check them out few more things we'll cover and like I said we'll go to the phones. Uh, widespread panic at the back room tomorrow night. Uh, coming to the back room, Agony Column, Saturday, May 2nd. Uh, Sunday night, now this you need to go check out. Split is playing at the back room Sunday night uh, with Shaken Fingers. Uh, Pirate Salad and Apocalyptic are also on that bill. I don't know a lot about them but uh, that's Sunday at the back room Split. They're a fine funk band. You need to go check them out. Monday, uh, Cartoon Sky, good band you need to check out. Uh, we're supposed to do some video. I don't think it's going to work, though. Uh, so Misled and Denim and Lace. Tuesday, Worm, Whammo's Organic Rubber Machine. You need to go see that. That's a wonderful thing. Whammo, what's up? You out there in TV land or what, man? Uh, Vertigo Zoom and Red Scare. Uh, Wednesday. Fury, Wasted Faith, Force Fed, and Insanity. Another metal show at the back room Wednesday the 29th. Fury's going to be on Capsize tomorrow night. So, uh, man, check it out. we got Fury, July Alley, and uh, Stretford going to be joining us on Capsize tomorrow night. So, now that I've talked enough to let y'all freak out for a while, we'll go to do the phone thing. It's you. What's up? Hey, Dave. Yeah, man. I was wondering, did you get paid to do this? Nah, sure don't. Well, why, why do you do it then? I uh, get to meet all the cool band members and get to all the cool clubs, man. Hello. Hey, fuck you. Okay. Hello. 
Hey man, you got any uh, Oak Town three five seven or two live crew? Not tonight, man. Watch watch uh, next Friday or something. Hello. Hey, hey, what's up, dude? Hanging out, man. Hey. Playing the stuff from the skate nigs and screw at the back room last night, dude. Hey, you going to Pearl Jam and Soundgarden? Do you know it, dude? We got some Pearl Jam tonight too. All right, dude. Sweet. All right. Keep well, up the good work, dude. Thanks for watching. Hey, hello. Hey, Dave. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, nothing much. Haven't heard from you in a while. Yeah, man. I've been doing the do, man. Doing the do, huh? Yeah. Cool. Well, I was wondering, did you bring Cypress Hill tonight? No, no rap tonight. We're doing a lot of metal tonight. This isn't raw time. What? This isn't raw time tonight. What is it? It's just hello. Hello? I don't know. I ain't got a name. Doesn't have to have one. No, man, it's a capsized video production, though. It is? Yeah. When does raw time want to be back on, man? Next Friday. All right. Okay, dude. Okay, man. I'll take you later. See ya. See. Hello. Hey. Hey. I put out a little magazine called Lost Armadillos in Heat. Oh, and yeah? I got a, got a letter from a guy from Wisconsin cool. asking about a band called Pain Teens. Hmm, you heard I've of heard of them. They're on like a Sub Pop or Touch and Go or something. Huh. One of those uh, grunge labels. Yeah, he was asking me about them, asking me about cassettes and stuff on them, and I had never heard of them. I've heard a good buzz about the band. I've never heard them myself. I've heard a lot of good things, though. Okay. They so play I'm with like Sugar Shack and Crust and ST37 and stuff, kind of alternative, psychedelic, on the edge kind of stuff. Okay, thanks, man. All right, thanks for watching, man. Hello. 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 Okay. Hello. Fuck you, Dave. Okay. Hello. Help me, I've been raped. Man, I th was it the guy that just called me? No, it was your pussy. Oh, well, I think that's what he wanted. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Dave, um, it's a capsized Gemini, uh, last right video. Um, I don't know, man. I'll have to take a look. I heard those guys were having a, a lineup change, and I don't know what's up with that. But, uh, uh, man, have you ever seen them before? They're oh, man, good. they're badass, yeah. Yeah. Good band. Well, if you can get some of that stuff, that'd be great, man. You See got later. it. You got it. Thanks for watching, man. Yeah. Hello. Hey, Dave. Hey. What's up, man? Man, doing this do, letting the freaky people cuss me out, I guess. Yeah, I just called my chronicle. I see Johnny Winter's going to be playing um, Liberty Lunch. Dude, you know who's going to be playing Tuesday night at Hondo's? Yeah, Peter Chris. I don't believe it, man. Yeah. Peter Chris at Hondo's Tuesday yeah. night. But I'll be at Soundgarden, so. Yeah, I'm going yeah, to try to go to Soundgarden, too. Cool, man. It's going to be um, a good show. I was wondering, do you have that, um, that video outshined? Um, yeah, I don't have it tonight, though. We're going to probably play that Tuesday yeah, after that's the... Yeah, a cool video. Yeah, after the Soundgarden show, we'll be jamming a bunch of Soundgarden, Swerve Driver, and Pearl Jam. Okay. So tune in Tuesday at midnight on uh, Channel 10. All right, I will. All right. All right, talk to you later. Okay, see ya. Hello. Here's my pussy. Hmm, y'all need to go to bed or get a life. I don't know if you got one, but hello. Hey. Yep. When are you going to show that Dangerous Toys interview again? Hmm, I don't know, man. Been getting a lot of requests for it. You know what you can do? Um, Monday, call programming it here at ACTV and tell them you want to see it. Okay. Okay? All right, thanks a lot. Sure, thanks for watching. <coughs> Hello? Uh, yeah, what and oh, when and what time is the Cool Butt Video show going to be? Uh, well, it's supposed to be May 8th, 1 to 2 a.m. All righty, cool. All right, I'm man. Looking forward to it. All right. <coughs> Hello? 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 Hey, man, you all play both seasons? Who? Bo Cephas? Yeah. Nah, I sure don't, man. Sorry. I like his dad, though. Hello. 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 Hey, you see any more of that screw tonight? Sure are, man. Yeah, that's pretty damn cool, man. It's badass, dude. I like it. Did you go to the show? Uh, no, I, I, first time I ever heard of him, right there. Ah, well, they got, they got some people, man, uh, former members of some cool bands around town. So, man, they're, they're doing it up now in that's a cool. major way, man. We'll be playing some here in a minute. All right. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. All right. See ya. Hello. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing great. How are you? Fine. Hey, right. do you have uh, Yes Lift Me Up? Uh, sorry, I sure don't. Oh, man, you need to get it. Good All right. Tune. Huh? It's a good tune. You need yeah. to get it. All right, man, I'll, I'll keep my eyes out and see if I can get a hold of it. All right, later. See ya. Hello. Okay. It's you. All right. Hi. And uh, what kind of station is this? Is it music? Yeah, we're going to be playing some screw that was recorded live at the beautiful back room last night here in Austin. Okay, what would you say if... Uh, like, two people are going out if they have different tastes of music. Yeah. And what would you say for them? Would you tell them to just break up or ah. what? Now, if two people, two people were to, two people like different kinds of music and they were like together in a relationship, uh -huh. oh man, that shouldn't be no problem. Because I, like no I, I, I like at least a dozen kinds of music. 
So you think they should compromise and just listen to each other's music? Yeah, definitely. Okay. All right. Thanks. Uh, watch that dog. Okay. Okay. Sure See ya. Hello? Hello. Howdy. Hey, what's up, Dave? Hanging out, man. What are you doing? Uh, not much. Messing around. Messing around, huh? Yeah. Um, are you going to play any Gore tonight? Sure are. We're going to play Sick of You. Oh, cool. You know they're coming to town. Oh, they are? Yeah. All right. Dude, radical. Two nights. And are you playing any Red Hot Chili Peppers tonight? No, sure not. Uh, uh, uh well, the people who are cussing you out. They'll, they'll be asleep in a little while. Yeah. I know their bedtime's got to be coming up real soon. Baggage, huh? Yeah. Well, I'll check you later, dude. Okay, see ya. All right. Those people are on the king. Beautiful. All those people are on the tip of the king bone. Let me tell you, king bone. Those guys must be cool. I saw an ad for those guys. They're playing tonight. Hey, what's up? Hey, Dave. Do you got the even flow video? Not yet. It hadn't, hadn't been released yet. We've got this neat little interview thing that we're going to play. Okay, um, pretty soon? Um, probably going to be a little while. Maybe about uh, 30, 45 minutes, but we got it. Chill, man. Get the um, rusty cage. A rusty cage. All right, man. We'll play that next Friday. Oh, or, well, actually, actually, we'll be playing that Tuesday after the Soundgarden show. We're going to play a bunch of Soundgarden. Oh, cool. You going? Oh, yeah, definitely. All right. See you down there. Okay, man. Oh, wait. And the swir uh, does Swerve Driver have any videos? Yeah, man. There's an interview running right now. Check the channels. It's uh, coming on in the next couple days, dude. Um, I'm running an interview with like three Swerve Driver videos. Um, you know the billboard that runs when there's no no uh, shows on? Oh, yeah. Check it out. It'll, it's like Sunday or Monday. All right. Thanks a lot, man. Okay. See you. Bye. Hello. 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 Yeah, when did Guar come to town? I don't know. Let me look at my beautiful Austin Chronicle, and I'll tell you. Uh, Gore is coming to town very soon. They're going to be playing Liberty Lunch, as usual, so it should be really cool. Uh, Monday and Tuesday, May 25th and 26th, though the end of next month. Okay. This is Jesse Alexander, so fuck Billy Porky. Yeah, okay. Hello. Hey, there. Hey. What's going on? Hanging, man. What are you? What happened to your backdrop? Oh, this is another room, man. I'm, this isn't raw time either, though. Oh, uh, since raw time, I was kind of getting used to your backdrop there. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. You, you turn it on now, and it, look real, it looks real professional now. Oh, okay. <laughs> it looks good, though. Yeah, it's a different room, you know. It's got it all this room. stuff. And, you what know. have your own room? Uh, it's, it's being used. We're using this little room tonight as a last-minute effort. What are those gadgets? Thank you. What are those gadgets? Oh, these gadgets? Yeah. This is like my monitor and my CG monitor and, and my output monitor and my tape decks. And let's see, what else can you see? Intercom, and co color bars and tone, and... Yeah, actually, you do those back here. It's a colorful poster back here on the back, and uh, it looked like your old room. Oh, yeah. See, this makes this do that. That's heavy. Yeah. So, so well, hey, how about some old Queens, Queens Rock if you got it, or some Vintage R.E.M.? Or who? Vintage R.E.M. if you got it, some old stuff. Oh, I've got, uh, It's the End of the World as We Know It. I might play that uh, next Friday. That'll work. Okay, man. Okay, dude. Thanks for watching. Later. See you. Take about four more calls and we're gonna play some more screw. And that guy got too scared to say anything. Hello. Howdy. Hello. How? Hey. Hey. Hello. Oh. Hey. Hello. Yeah. Hey there. Hey there. Hey man, are you gonna play some new kids on the block tonight? Oh, uh, we played that and Michael Jackson and Wham three shot in a row, but you missed it, man. Sorry. Hello. You got some climate? Uh, not tonight, man. We're gonna play Jerry was a race car driver Friday though. All right. All cool. right. Peace. Raw, uh, hey not, man. not raw time. Sam, what's up? Hanging, man. What are you doing? I'm uh, just chilling here listening to you listen to all those weirdos, man. Yeah, that's a fact, man. Hey, man. Whatever happened to that dude with the guitar, man? Who? That dude from Raw Time Friday last time. What, the guy who won it? Yeah. He came down Saturday night and picked it up. He plays in a really cool band called No Good Boyo. Uh, Good band. I'm glad it was a guitar player, too, at least, huh? <laughs> Something about giving away Pearl Jam tickets, man. Yeah, they they were giving away, man. That was the second second prize. Oh, I thought you were going to be like giving away besides the contest. Or something. Oh no, that was our second runner-up prize for the contest. You know what? We're giving away a Stevie Ray Vaughan model uh, Fender guitar now, though. We'll win. We're going to do the drawing the last Friday of May, which I believe is uh, oh hell, I don't remember, but it's the last Friday in May. Hey man, did you ever know a uh, group that used to play at the back room called Enigma? Yeah. Uh, wait, Enigma? Yeah. No, I, rem I remember uh, the band that got signed called Enigma that did Sadness and all that. No, it was a, it was a group at the back room. Hmm, I don't I remember. The, the singer's name was Chip. Mm-mm. Uh, take it easy, man. All right, man, check out this screw we're fixing to play, dude. All right, dude. All right.
Everybody, thanks for watching. We're fixing to roll some screw. Screw is on Metal Blade Records. I hear they got something coming up on Metal Blade you'll be able to go get. And, uh, man, if you like them, call me up and tell me what you think. If you saw them, call me up and tell me what you think of the show. Uh, I heard they're fixing to go on a European tour, uh, opening for, like, Godflesh. So that should be really cool. We're going to roll this tape here. This is uh, Screw, recorded at the back room last night. See ya.
Uh, we're going to take some phone calls, oops, in the meantime, and uh, turn that down so I don't blast y'all's ears out. Um, the uh, Pearl Jam show is Tuesday at the City Coliseum, so uh, hopefully y'all have got your tickets to that because uh, from what I hear, it's sold out, and uh, you're going to have to pay some major bucks to go see that show because uh, that's like the, the, the Seattle grunge thing from hell. I mean, um, you got Swerve Driver from London, and they do the uh, grunge thing really well. And then you got, of course, Pearl Jam and Soundgarden from the Seattle scene. And uh, who knows, they might even play some Temple of the Dog stuff. I don't know. Uh, what's up? Hello. Hey. Hey. Hey, what's up, Dave? Hanging, man. Oh, man. Uh, I didn't know if I got the right number or not. Uh, yeah, I think it's so. It's first time view, man. It's a cool show. Oh, well, cool. This isn't what we usually do, but, uh, man, definitely thanks for tuning in. From fr yeah. Friday nights, we usually play a lot of national videos only, and then Saturday nights, we play nothing but Texas stuff. Hey, man, that but, uh, Stevie Ray was bad. Hell yeah, I mean, it was. It's like perfect music for our, for our fixed to crash out. And I just huh. came up from Houston, oh, yeah? with some friends. And cool. It's a cool show. Well, I, I appreciate you uh, tuning in, man. You're just hanging out in Austin for a little while? Yeah, I just come up and smoke college buddies still live up here. And we just, I was just kicking back, talking to Betty. Not, not to crash out. Yeah? It's just a pretty wild show. You, uh, you know any bands there in Houston that you dig? Oh, man. Like Dead Horse, maybe? Well, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not too much into the, to the metal. I, That's like cool. Steve Ray, I mean, I, I'm more into the blues. Kind gotcha, of, gotcha, kind man. Of, I'm just not a big metal fan, but That's it's a cool. cool show. I watched a little bit of that Screw a while ago. It's not, you know, I had nothing against it. I'm just not a... Not a metal fan. Yeah, it's not a metal fan, but it's a cool gotcha. show. Well, thanks, man. All right, man. Well, have a good night. All right, man. Take uh, take right, take a little bit of Austin back to Houston with you. <coughs> Hello. Hey, man. That was the best video I think I've ever seen in my whole fucking entire life. It was, dude. <laughs> what are you doing, Dave? Hanging, man. What are you doing? Just got off work, man. You know, scrubbing them dishes sure does fucking suck, but it's an honest buck. So yeah, I don't worry about so. nobody taking away my kid. Yeah, right? So what That's did you cool. do? Did you sure look handsome this evening? Did you get laid recently? Uh, as a matter of fact. <laughs> you have that. Every that, day. That glow about you, big guy. E every day. I got that hand action, dude. <laughs> hey, man, uh, I'm looking forward to checking out some of that video stuff. From that last night, huh? wild, man. After did it? Split. Did it? Oh, yeah. Damn. The booze happened. Yeah, yeah. Then that was 8 o'clock in the morning, man, and phew. Hey, did, it all, really did it all go well? Yeah, it went well. No disturbances? No disturbances. Boy, yeah. but the loss hung out outside for a while, man, yeah. waiting for everybody to leave. Yeah, I noticed, man. You noticed? Yeah, they were riding around in circles, dude. And you left anyway? Yeah. You're the man, dude. I don't drink, man. Well, then, so that's cool. Right? Yeah. And you don't have one shot or nothing. Right. I got a clean well, record. Don't little drink, little. man. Didn't have nothing. I mean, I was... I, bet you it was. I was running red lights. <laughs> with the law behind you. Not That's right. Kid. Not even. Cool. Well, man, I know there was a bunch of rug rats hiding in the back room, man. Yeah, man, there was, was, man. That place, is, that place is hot with all those lights now, huh? I would have to say so, man. That's a cool little party place, man. And the way that they had the invitation only. Yeah. Um, Matt Looney doing the uh, head bashing at the front. He did it well. You, he's a dick when he wants to be, dude. Yeah, I'm glad he's my friend. Yeah, right? You know, yeah, we'll have to take dick lessons from Looney for sure, man. <laughs> hey, He's got it. Dude, you're, you're pretty much the biggest one in the house. That's what Roger said. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> I can't diss nobody, y'all, because Roger don't like me to diss people. <laughs> but that's cool, that. man. He I don't. I said I was gonna, I was gonna take some of the blame, but he fucking. It was just me. Out of the way and pointed at you, said, David. It's you, buddy. I don't understand what it was. Anything that I said that was misconstrued as being. Uh, Anything against the back room, please forgive me. Well, it's man, the not true. Is, the only reason I think people just the back room is because it's the only club that there is. Uh, the back room is beautiful. I wish we had six or seven more of them. Right, exactly. So it's the only thing that people can talk about. Man. Right. And it's got such a monopoly on the whole um, rock scene right now. Yeah. It's, um, it, 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 it's the only thing to death. So. But man, there's shows you can't beat, man. I mean, I was looking, dude. It's like crazy, man. You can't beat the lineup of bands they get in there, dude. I mean, what? Billy Goat Tonight, uh, Dead Horse Entombed, Exhorter coming up, Badlands, Agony Column, Chris Whitley, Toad the Red Sprocket, Eddie Money, Social Eddie Money. Eddie Money. She, 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 she was shaking. 
Speaking of shaking, they're shaking finger. Eddie money before that. Huh? Eddie money was cool before she. Became. Yeah, yeah, doing the, the give me some water stuff. Yeah, dude, you know, fucking hippie. <laughs> Righteous, Dave. Righteous, dude. So am I gonna be able to see you anytime soon? Yeah, man, I'm off tomorrow, so we'll get together tomorrow for sure. Yeah, please do. I'm gonna drink this moosehead, smoke this stoke, and uh, watch some more of the tube. Do you take a shower, or wipe some of this Kirby Lane grunge off? Kirby of Lane life. funk. Dude, that ain't no lie, man. Like, you walk out of there with a layer of funk on you, but that's any kitchen, you know? Yeah, that's true. That's true, and, man. Man, just working. So like, that, work. that Kirby's got that Chipotle funk. <laughs> that old crew funk. <laughs> that's true, man. Hey, man, well, look, dude, you're looking good. You got that glow about you, man. Looking it's forward terrible, to man. Bass. Hey, see ya. <laughs> see ya. Hello. Hello, Dave. Yes. What's up? Uh, smoke alarm. <laughs> so, man, you got a kill for and blame nods. What? And blame nards. What? And blame nards. No, I don't think so, man. Not lately. All right. See ya. Hello. Say, man, I, um, met Gibby the other night at L.A. Guns. Uh-huh. You know, man, what the hell band is he in? Butthole um, Surfers? <laughs> is he in Butthole Surfers? Yeah. Well, I thought, he's in Butthole Surfers. Okay, is he in Ministry? Uh, no. Or is he but if you think that he is, a mole might appear on your forehead in road black and extend from your head in 47 miles in 69 different directions. Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, dude, um, yeah, haven't you seen that video? It's like, um, he's in it, though. Yeah, the ministry, uh, ding-dang, ding-a-dong, ding-dong video. Uh, yeah. Is, is there a band, was he in a band called, um, uh, some Jesus Built My Hot Rod? Yeah, that's the ministry song, man. Oh, it's not a band? Uh-uh. Okay, man. Well, I'll shine you later. We'll, we'll play it. We'll play it in a while, okay? All right. See you. Hello. Hey. Hey. Right, um, I was wondering if you're going to play any Pearl Jam. Next. You are? Yeah, next. Okay, well. Well, hell, man. I'll play, this, so I'll play it right, right now. Right now, but I'm, I'm in the back room with my girl. Well, I'm going to play Pearl Jam right now. You are? Uh-huh. Okay, well, um, I was wondering, um, am, is the Pearl Jam concert sold out? Yes. It is? Yeah, will there be people like uh, scalping tickets scalping and, and stuff like that? Taking your money gladly. Say what? They'll gladly take your money. They will. Yes, all of it. I'm oh, sure they will. <laughs> all of it. of it. Though. Yep. I'll be broke, man. Yep, but you'll see Pearl Jam and Soundgarden. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Soundgarden, they're my favorite. <laughs> yeah, well, you ought to break your rusty cage. No, man, I, what? You ought to break your rusty cage. I know, man. Soundgarden is like a. I mean, I could do without. <coughs> now, do you know who's going to be at the back room next, though? Uh, what do you mean next? Well, like, like, tonight's Billy Goat, tomorrow night's Widespread Panic. What, what, um, do you know who's going to be there next Wednesday? Uh, I can look. I know Thursday is going to be Dead Horse, dude. Wednesday uh, is going to be Fury and Wasted Faith, dude, and Force Fed and Insanity. Oh, wait, when is Dead Horse going to be there? Thursday. Oh, dude, I gotta go see them. They're pretty good. Dead Horse, Entombed, and Exhorter at uh, the back room Thursday. Definitely. Dude, they're awesome. I gotta go see them, man. Yeah, uh, you can't miss it, man. It's gonna be That's a great show. Though. So Fury, Fury's gonna be on Capsize tomorrow night, so check oh, those is? guys out. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. They're playing Wednesday night at the back yeah, room. Dude.
Hello. Hey, dude. What's up? What do you think? What do you think of Def Leppard's new album? I think it sucks, my, you know. And, and didn't they sound shitty on that fucking? They song? always sound shitty. They suck, man. They suck hard, dude. All right, dude. Just see what you think, dude. All right, man. Thanks Later. for your input. Later. <laughs> you know what I can't believe about Def Leppard though is the fact that Vivian Campbell plays guitar for him. That sucks. What's Hello? up? Yeah, it's you. You gonna play any program tonight? Dude, weren't you just watching? No, I need some more. No, nah, that's it. Come on. Sorry. Please? Sorry. Hello. Hey. Hey. This is the guy who uh, wanted you to show the Pearl Jam. Well, did you see it? Yeah, man. What'd you think? Thanks, it was awesome, dude. Bitchin'. Hey, man, Um, are you all gonna play any ACDC here? No, nah, we're gonna play some Body Count next. Okay, let's go. What about... Oh, are you going to play any of the rest of the night or anything? ACDC? Yeah. No, uh -uh, sorry, uh -huh. don't have any. That's an awesome album. Yeah, what, the new one? Yeah. The latest one? Back Which one? Butt. Oh, the loud, the old one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I got you, man. What about um, any Pink Floyd or anything? No, nothing like that, man. Oh, man. Sorry. What about any more? Uh, we got Skate Nigs coming up. What's that? Skate Nigs. Hey, they're pretty good. They're badass, dude. They are badass. Ass out the butt, dude. Dude, did you see him at the back room last <laughs> I, night? I was going to leave on my video. VCR, yeah. You, whatever you call the thing. Yeah, you ought to leave it on all night, dude. We'll be playing <laughs> yeah. all sorts of good stuff. Why not? Um, Why not? What else is coming up? Do you know? Uh, Skate Nigs recorded live at the back room last night. Body Count, Corrosion of Conformity, uh, Death, Ministry, Godflesh, Curve, Course of Empire, Butthole Surfers. Oh, Butthole Surfers? Butthole Surfers. <laughs> They're awesome. Cool, man. Um, yeah, man. No, I was with, I, was, I gotta tell you this, this is so funny. I was with my girl the other night. Yo, man, she, she was, she wasn't very good. I had to dump her, it was. Breaks my heart, man. Oh, uh, hey, do you got any, uh, Cypress Hill? Not tonight, uh, we got the hand on the pump thing we'll be playing next Friday. Okay, how about Foo Schnickens? Um, no, uh, if you call that little bitty number down at the bottom of the screen, wherever it is. See, it's on my TV up here. Yeah. But it's called 473-3848. Uh, leave me a reminder, and I'll try to bring it next Friday. Okay. 
All right. Well, everybody go to Sanitarium tomorrow to check out Retarded Elf and El Flaco. Wow. I forgot all about that show. There's nothing in the Chronicle. At least I didn't see well, it. Well, the Chronicle kind of misprinted the date. <laughs> they what said a drag. March 28th. Ooh. That's kind of uh, history. Kind of goofy. Retarded Elf is definitely dope. Yeah, come check us in out. In the house. I'd love to. Uh, the thing is, I do my television show on the weekends. Yeah. And I never can come see the Elf. The Elf is one of the best bands in Austin, though. And I'm like, it aggravates the shit out of me to no end that I can't see the band anymore. I, you know, I haven't even seen them with Doug. Oh, man. Not at all. see that. Not at all. I mean, video that Travis played, that one camera video. But, man, I'd love to come out and shoot a real video. Hopefully, they'll call me next time they play the back room. And we'll try to get it set up in advance. Uh, Wubba called me the last time that the back room show happened, and we just couldn't get it together in time because we needed three weeks' advance notice. But uh, well, we got um, Liberty Lunch coming up May something. It, it, May twenty second. That's pretty cool and all, but uh, you know that the that the lights and sound at the back room though can't be beat for video. Yeah, this is true. You know, so I mean that's something you got to think about. <laughs> Okay, but cool. Thanks for calling. And hey, Elf is in the house. All right. Okay. Mate. See. You. Retarded Elf, man. That's gonna be a bad show. Y'all go check it out. Sanitarium. Yo. Oh, dude. Yeah. Hey, I'd just like to say that that Pearl Jam thing was really cool. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah. Are you gonna play that like again tonight or like mm. next weekend or something? No, nah, man. I may play it Tuesday night though. As a matter of fact, I'm sure I'll play it Tuesday night. Oh, uh, okay. Channel 10 at midnight. Okay. Cool. See you. Bye right, bye. Actually, at midnight on Channel 10, uh, this Tuesday is going to be a live set from Austin uh, Art Rock, if that's what you want to call them, killer band called December. I'm sure you're all aware who they are. Uh, they're going to be playing live for us in the studio down the hall uh, where Kevin did his show tonight with uh, the Coffee Sergeants. Uh, December is going to play at midnight till 1 a.m. on Channel 10, Tuesday night. Uh, and then we're going to do that freaky freestyle thing and play a bunch of Soundgarden and Swerve Driver and Pearl Jam, seeing as the show was that night. So uh, we'll, we'll have a bunch of reports on how the show went, too. Y'all uh, make sure and remember to call in after the show. Hello. Thank you. Hello. 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 Are y'all going to play any Luke Skywalker tonight? No, I'm sorry. We don't have any tonight. All right. Thank you. See you. Hello. Hey, man, when are you going to have the even flow? Uh... I don't know. MTV's got an exclusive on it right now, so, you know. Fuck MTV. Man. Exactly. Exactly. Thanks for your sentiment. Howdy. Hello. 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 Hey, place he'll see. Okay. Vote with a bullet. And vote with a ballot, too. Howdy. Hey. Yeah. You're the best, man. Who? You. You. Yeah, you. Look in the TV camera. No, look. At, there you go. Yeah, you. I'm pointing oh, at you. You okay. see me? You're the only reason I have cable. Dude, that rules. I'm serious. Thanks a lot, man. Take it easy. All right, Keep thanks for up. calling in, dude. You bet. That rules, man. You know, see, every call I get like that makes up for the jerks that I get that call all night that uh, are up past their bedtime. We should get a robot to kill them all, man. That would be the ticket. We'll send them into a uh, digital nightmare. Oh, your TV's up way too loud. Oh, we'll go to fucking hell, okay? God damn it. Oh, I've been there, and they kidding <laughs> me out, dude. They don't, they don't uh, like my kind of people around there. Hello. Hey, how's it going? Doing well. How are you? Well... So I got the Mr. Bungle show the other night. Cool, man. I was too confused to wonder what was going on. <laughs> Are you going to play any Mr. Bungle this evening? Uh, no, we're not playing it tonight, man. If you uh, would like to see it on Friday, call 473-3848 and let me know. Cool. What did you think of the show? I was confused. I did not know anything of what they were about other than John Travolta's song. Uh, God, you need to check out that, that CD. It's so good. I'd love to, man. Maybe I'd understand it a little more. It's pretty bizarre, man. It's definitely wild. Yeah, that, that's for sure. To say the least. But anyway, keep it up. Take it easy. All right, man. Uh, stay tuned for the skate nick stuff, man. Definitely. I saw the show last it's night. It's going to drive you wild. All right. Video's bad, man. <laughs> Later. See ya. Hello. Dude. 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 Hey, man, did you uh, bring any, let's see, infectious grooves? No. No. Corrosion of, con no. Corrosion of conformity, God flesh. Um, Bunch of really cool stuff, though. Hey, what's Chain Addiction's new band? What's the name? What's um, the Perry Farrell and Stephen, what you call it, Perkins, I believe, Perkins. on drums. Yeah, they they got a new project called uh, Porno for Pyros. <laughs> Pretty bizarre. Cool. Yeah. Okay, what about uh, Radioactive Goldfish? Never heard. Well, I, I can't say I never heard of them. I never heard them. Never heard them. Pretty mm. cool. Yeah. Hey, what else is this? 
I do. Maybe uh, uh, what's up? I was talking to uh, yeah, my friend. Man. Oh, okay. Well, thanks you for calling. Show, man. Thanks a lot, man. Later, See you. A few more calls, and we're going to play some more video. Yo. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Automatic redial, redial, redial. Hello. Uh, hello. 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 Oh, yeah. Um, can I have a large pizza with sardines? Uh, we got a special for anchovies as opposed to sardines. Oh. Okay. Try the spam special. It rules. Hello. Oh, yeah. Fucking fine. All right, dude. Is there any way you can get, like, a hold of some live stuff? Like from, from maybe Megadeth Rusted Pieces or something like that. Clip mm. them all, some old stuff, dude. Nah, I can't play that. That's for your home video stuff, man. Fuck. You can't get nothing like that, dude? Uh-uh. All right, man. Thanks for watching, though, dude. Kind of kind of frustrated there, it sounded like. Man, I hate to frustrate you anymore, but... Uh... One, I'm very nervous, and it feels weird to be up here. And two, it's been a long fucking time. It's all called Meltdown! <laughs> Down, boy, you 
up the guitar dude there went the neighborhood I don't know what to tell you man he, he just burned it up that them guys with the guitars I just don't understand that stuff man anyway that was the incredible the incomparable ice tea and body count I'm sure you're aware of that all y'all dig that uh, hopefully some of you guys came down to raw time last week and picked up some of the posters we had to give away because they're all gone now uh, we're going to take some more phone calls here in a minute, and uh, next video you will be seeing is by request, uh, going out to the guy who requested it, man. We're going to play the brand new Corrosion of Conformity, Vote with a Bullet, uh, from their Blind album. Uh, it's that kind of uh, time of the year where you got to vote with a bullet or a ballot, either way, man. Uh, they both work, but you got to stand up and make your choice known, and that's what I think this video is about. Uh, we'll definitely be kicking it for you here in a minute. But uh, just y'all, y'all be cool and shit. We'll take your calls here in a minute. But I definitely want to get you fixed up with this corrosion of conformity. Uh, just talking to this cat on the phone about Badlands. Uh, definitely a badass uh, blues metal band, if that's what you want to call it. Jakey Lee. I'm sure you all know who he is and who he has played with. The Ozman. We love you all. And uh, you know Jakey Lee is hot. Uh, that's his band, and they're playing at the back room next Friday, May 1st. So definitely go check that out. Two nights in a row. Well, technically, uh, you could probably count all week. Let me see what we got. I know uh, um, you heard me earlier, but man, three nights in a row. Wednesday, Fury, Wasted Faith, Force Fed, and Insanity. Thursday, Entombed, Dead Horse, and Exhorter. And then Friday, Badlands. I mean, wham, bam, bam. What the hell kind of shit is that? They're trying to blow our ears out. That's what they're trying to do. They're trying to make everybody go deaf. That's what it is. Hello. Hey, I just wanted to let you know that I think your show is probably the best on television. Hey, coolness. Throw money. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. Thanks You're for uh, watching. Thanks for taking the time to call in. Sure. All right. Bye-bye. See ya. Coolness. Howdy. How you doing? Doing okay. How are you? All right. I had a question. Uh, do you know... Who sings that song? I think it's called "If You Really Love Me, You Just Go Away." Is that Junkyard? Um, if you really just life. love me, you just go away. That's it. Yeah, Junkyard. Um, do they, do they have a new album coming out or something? Uh, their last album was uh, sixes, sevens, and nines, I oh, think. It's off that one. Uh, actually, that song I think is from the first one. Oh, okay. Don't quote me on that. I could be wrong. Go buy both of them. They're both good. All right. <laughs> uh, one more thing. Sure. Didn't Ice T sound kind of like Jimi Hendrix when he was singing? Who? Ice T. Nah. You don't think so? Nah. Oh well, I thought so. I think Ice T and Henry Rollins are the same guy, though. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. All right, later. Hello. Yo, man, I Yo. called that last week. Remember, you were supposed to play that Ramones Tonight video. No way, man. Why not? We got we got a uh, Blitzkrieg Bop is the only one we've got. What about the um, a tribe called Quest of Flavor Fraud? Uh, that's gonna be Friday. Which one? Wait, which one? The tribe called Quest. Yeah, which video? The Flavor Fraud. No, nah, the, the only ones I've got are by Tribe Called Quest are Jazz. We got Jazz and uh, Scenario. Oh, okay then, man. Okay, man. Great. See ya. Yellow. Hey. Hey. What's going on? Hanging out, man. Oh, not much, man. Uh, I dig your show, man. It's Thanks. neat. I've seen this for the first time, man. I really enjoy it. Tonight was your first... Man, that's kick-ass. Tonight's your um, first time to watch the show? Uh, what do I look forward to jamming to Guess next? You can't hear me. Uh, we're going we're gonna to play uh, Corrosion of Conformity next, dude. All right. Take it easy, man. All right. Thanks for tuning in, man. See ya. <laughs> Hello. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. When was that uh, uh, concert for life going to be on? Concert for Life, the uh, Freddie Mercury thing? Yeah. 
uh, tomorrow at noon on MTV. Or actually, yeah, I think I just saw Metallica on it, dude. Cool, man. On what? On the MTV. On today. MTV, they played it. I get. Uh, I saw the inner crap. It's Jed's song, dude. But I don't know. It sounded better than the Grammys or the other one. Cool. But uh, what, what's the COC one? Vote with a bullet, right? Yeah, vote with a bullet. Well, the guitarist is singing, right? I don't know. I haven't seen it yet. Yeah, dude. You watch it. The, the lead singer ain't even in there. What a trip. I don't know, dude. But it's, he sings better anyway. Okay. Well, how about the Ramones, man? Uh, not tonight, man. You got it. When? We got Blitzkrieg Bop. Maybe we'll bring that along next Friday. All right, dude. Okay. All right, man. Thank you. See ya. Hey, hello. Hey, man. How's it going? I'm doing well. How are you? Pretty good. Cool. Hey, I was wondering, um, I was really hoping you might be able to play a little ministry tonight. Um, we've got Jesus Built My Hot Rod. Hey, that that's the one I was looking for, dude. We'll, we'll do it, man. All right. All right. Get up, dude. See ya. Later. Hey, hello. Hey, hello. See ya. Hello. Yeah, you know that Freddie Mercury tribute concert? Yeah. That sucked. Yeah, pretty much, man. Can you believe they had Liza Minnelli on there? Yeah, it was pretty weird, man. Oh, God. All right, man. Okay, see you. Later. Hello. Hey. Hey. Um, I got this new song I want you to hear, okay? Okay. I won't play the whole thing. I'll just play a little bit. Okay. I saw the headlines just the other day. Says the woman that Beautiful, man. I decided that we're going to play Skate Nigs right now.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the skate nigs presented at the back room last night. They tore it up. They moshed it up. They uh, chopped it up. Uh, Y'all call in with your comments about that. Uh, I had some interesting calls during during the video, so uh, maybe y'all will call back and we'll talk a little bit on the air about what you thought about that. Uh, some guy thought it was sick and ludicrous. What did you think? Uh, I thought he had a pretty closed mind, pretty like narrow. Uh, if you uh, can't can't enjoy something, you know, flip the channel and uh, maybe your mother told you once, uh, maybe you ought to remember, if you can't say anything nice, don't say nothing at all. It's public, man. It's uh, freedom of speech. It's where it's at. That's what, uh, what makes it so cool, makes it so happening, so hip. Uh, I, I promise I'm still going to play that uh, Corrosion of Conformity video. Um, it'll be in the next video we play, I guess, since I promised you I was going to play it. But um, I've never seen it, so I don't know what it's about. Somebody told me the guitar player was singing or something like that. Uh, we're going to go back to the phones. Hello. Hey, um, I was wondering, do you guys might have any gore? Yeah, we've got Sick of You. All right, Dad, do you think you might be able to get that one? Sure, sure, no problem. Thanks, appreciate it. See ya. Bye. Hello? Hey, man, what's going on? Hanging, man. What are you doing? Hanging, watching the skate nigs. Well, so the skate nigs, they're pretty okay. Yeah, I thought so. And I was talking like, man, I saw this band called Warthog, 2001 UK. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever heard of them, but they're no. pretty rad, man. I saw them tonight over at Emo's. Oh, wow. Agony Column played at Emo's. No, tonight. they're playing tomorrow night. Agony oh, Column and Chain Drive tomorrow night. I think it's free if you're over 21. Yeah, that's what I heard. So, yeah, yeah hopefully there'll be some people showing up because it should be a good show. I think so. Is that other band you mentioned, uh, are they from Austin? Oh, uh, Warthog? Yeah. Yeah, indeed, they are. They're, uh, like, possibly linked with... Well, I don't want to talk about it now, but oh. anyways, well, I man. just want to say the skate things, you know, pretty much suck. Call that little uh, number and get that band on the show. Okay. You, you don't like the skate nigs, though? Well, I don't know. What Did you think it was gore-like at all? No, I didn't, because gore can't play their instruments, dude. But have you heard, like, Live from Antarctica, dude? Yeah. Well, you know, I mean, it's like, I don't know, it's like, you could, like, draw comparisons. Yeah, I guess so. But anyways, yeah, I'll call, we'll call the number, man. Sounds good. Right. See ya. Hello. Uh, yeah, I'm the one that you said was so close-minded. Yes. And since, since you and I sp uh, spoke for quite a, a, a long time, Sh I'm just share, make, with, share with I'm, my I'm viewers. I'm going to make a real brief kind of encapsulation to the audience that might be watching it. Kind Please of do. Say what I just told you. And, Please do. Uh, let me just kind of separate it into two categories, my comments on the video, the stuff you're showing. Yeah. Uh, for, and, and if you make some sarcastic remarks, I'm, like you made, I'm just shushed. Like you made to me on a moment ago about why you're watching this video. Like I was flipping through the dial and I saw it. I could not believe it. First of all, from a musical standpoint, and I'm a person with a very extensive musical background, all kinds of areas of music, there is no musical quality to that at all. It has nothing to do with taste or it has nothing to do with my personal preference. There is nothing musical at all about what you just showed. It takes no talent to sit there and scream and yell and show some crotch you know, of a woman in leather panties. Uh, and pulling people's pants up. No, no talent involved there at all. And uh, we've had, you know, thousands and thousands of years of development of all kinds of music and art and culture. And uh, I'm, I have room for all kinds of different kind of styles, even though I don't, I don't prefer all of them. But that right there is just trash from a musical and artistic standpoint. Secondly, I think it's really, really sad that when we just gone through the last couple of days of hideous news about this sexual and violent crime against Colleen Reed, that you would entertain an audience in Austin on, on television like this by showing that kind of sadistic, violent, and overtly uh, uh, degrading sexual stuff about women there, um, when that very attitude that was kind of conveyed in the entertainment you were just showing is what leads to this sexual violence that has been uh, that is being carried out like these these terrible yogurt shop murders with these young girls and, and the uh, abduction and uh, apparent rape and murder of Colleen Reed. And I think there's, if you can't see that, if you can't see that, that the very attitude that, that's behind that kind of entertainment is what leads to the sexual degradation of women and all the violent sexual attacks and the, the, the uh, uh, child abuse that we're having and, and sexual crimes, incest, if you cannot see that, that's, uh, uh, that what you're showing there is very much... Uh, leads to that kind of attitude and if you can't see the trash that's involved there and how I, I, I guess I just cannot believe that you would have the nerve to show that kind of stuff even within a couple of days period here when uh, people are, are, are just sick at their stomachs about what's happened uh, to, some, to some women in our area and I, I just really resent that you're showing that kind of stuff as entertainment.
Okay, that's thank you. That's all I have to say. Okay. Howdy. Yeah, dude, I got something to say to that dude, man. Okay. It, uh, listen up, shit kicker. Just because you don't like it mean it ain't no good. So they must be doing something right because people enjoy it and I enjoy it. Get your Wranglers on. Get on your horse and ride back on home, pal. <laughs> hey, hello. Uh, yeah, I want to comment on what the guy said before. Please do. And uh, I think this guy's inbred. He needs to pull his head out of his ass. And I do like the skate nicks, but I think the chick needs to get more naked. <laughs> That's all I had to say. Thank you very much. Hello? Hey, Dave. Yeah. Was that Mayor Bruce Todd? I think so, man. <laughs> yeah. That was that was just plain Mayor Todd, Todd. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So what did you think about the video, man? Oh, I watched it. I thought it was pretty cool. Yeah? Some interesting props there. Yeah, do you think that contributes to the violence and sickness of society and degradation of society? No, it's just an act. I don't, yeah. I don't think it should be taken as seriously. Yeah, I don't think so either, man. You know, but so when who am I to say? When's this Gore concert, man? Gore is playing uh, Monday and Tuesday, May 25th and 26th, I believe, at Liberty Lunch. Let me double check. Yeah. Agony yeah. Column's playing Liberty Lunch, too. Yeah, Agony Column's playing, uh, I think, tomorrow night. Yeah, tomorrow night for free. For free? Yeah, at Emo's, uh, 603 Red River. I might try to go to that. You, you ought to, man. It's going to be a big party. All right, talk to you later. See ya. We got insane and king carcass Hello? too. Yeah. Hello? Yeah, I wonder who the fuck that teed was that was on here earlier. It was God. <laughs> who was that chick that was on the video? I don't know, man. Some some uh, prop for the show, man. Some friends of skate nigs. I, I don't know. She's pretty cool though. Yeah, man. Uh, Disco Vandals on uh, their skate team. Cool, man. And, uh, oh, hold on. Here's somebody. Else. Hey, man, I just want to say that uh, I wouldn't want to meet that chick in a dark alley somewhere. And she'd kick your ass, man. Yeah, I think she would. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. All right, man, we'll be cool. One time, Peace. Disco Vandals. Man. Disco Vandals. <coughs> Whoever Disco Vandals are. Hello. Hello. Hello, am I here? Yeah. Yeah, well, I just wanted to call and comment to that guy who was uh, calling up and saying that, you know, that, you know, it's showing you a little sex thing from the skate nags and stuff. It's mm -hmm. like a reflection of the degradation of society. Mm -hmm. I think that guy's full of shit. <laughs> I saw that show. I was there. That was, God damn it, that was entertaining. That was entertainment. It was entertainment. In itself. It was great. I was there like three shows ago for the skate nags when they had like a live video shoot. Yeah, we got that they video. They had two naked girls with yeah. like... They were engaged in lesbotic activity. It was great. And twice as much leather. Twice as much leather, twice as much nudity, <laughs> twice... The girls were rubbing all over each other. It was fantastic. That's right. You know, I think you should show, like, that two live crew video you got. You know, yeah, show yeah. that thing. Yeah, Show man. that thing and really piss this guy off. Yeah, I'm you know. challenging this guy. Call back. Show your two live crew video. Get him to call back. Hey, you know, I really mean... Really piss him off. These people need to be pissed off. People like the skate pigs are product of the shitty American society in which we live today. I got to know if you're doing this while you're talking. Well, I'm doing that, but it's a, it's a uh, camel light, you know? Gotcha, so, gotcha. You know? Yeah, well, I, I agree, with, uh, agree with your statement. I don't know, man. Maybe he's already pissed off, but that's not what we're trying to do. We don't but, need to know. piss people off, but we need to uh, wear people in today's society to be got, tolerant, you know? To got be just tolerant as much, of uh, other races, other colors, other creeds, other societies, other yeah. cultures, you know? If this guy doesn't appreciate this, he doesn't call it high culture, he likes opera, ballet, or whatever, just you know, go fine. He doesn't write. He has the choice. He doesn't need to criticize. Well, know? he said, you know, I, I, he understands he could just change the channel. Apparently, he was just flipping through and it kind of disturbed him, you know, but uh, personally, you know, I don't care. I see things that disturb me, and I just go on about my business, uh, you know, like well, I said. you're a cool guy. He's a bastard. <laughs> you know? Gotcha, man. Gotcha. You know, All right. take it easy, man. See ya. Thanks for calling, man. That's a definitely interesting, uh, de interesting input. Uh, tonight is Emo's grand opening, as well as tomorrow night. It's uh, the Houston Club comes to Austin, and anyone who patronized Pooties or was there for uh, South by So What, I mean South by so Southwest, already knows what a great space it is. Their emphasis is not on live shows. They do claim to have a cool jukebox, though, uh, but there is no cover ever. 
uh, when bands play there. They're kicking things off with Jesus Christ Superfly and Trouser Trout, which was tonight, and Agony Column with Chain Drive tomorrow night. Uh, let's see, Tuesday the 28th, which is the night of Soundgarden, brings New York City's Noise Mongers, the Unsane, to town with King Carcass and the Cherubs opening. Butthole Surfers had a song called Cherub. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see if we got any more input on the vid. Howdy. Uh, yeah. That guy that called right after that shithead uh -huh. called him bitch. Yeah. I was in Shoal Creek with that guy. His name is John Reyna, room 202. <laughs> this is Scott, man. What's going on? What's up, man? Um, yeah, that guy's kind of fucking stupid. Play some public enemy or something. Okay, man. All right, let's. Peace. Hello. Hey. Hey. Could you play a uh, Little Wing? Uh, we already played it since tonight, man. Sorry. All right. What about Love Stroke? Uh, not tonight. You know, we're fixing to play a bunch of Steve Ray Vaughan here in the future because we're giving away one of those Steve Ray Vaughan model Fender guitars. Oh, really? Yeah, we're gonna. You can send your postcards to PO Box three three two nine two, Austin, Texas seven eight seven six four, or drop by Ray Hennig's in about a week, and we'll have some entry blanks. All right, cool deal. Do you think you'll be getting any more videos? Yeah, we've got Love Struck Baby. We've got uh, Little Wing, and we've got uh, the houses. If the houses are rocking, don't bother knocking. I think something like that, and then we also got the Vaughn Brothers videos. All right, cool deal, thanks. Thanks for watching, man. I guess we'll take a few more calls, see if you guys have any more input about the video, and I'm going to roll the corrosion of conformity stuff. Hello. 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 I was just wondering about Joe Republican that called, said that he was flipping through the channels and saw that on. Yeah. How do you know the phone number to call you if he was just flipping through the channels and that You got on? a good point. And oh, wait, yeah. I know what it was. I know what it was. I flashed that little deal up that said, if you like the skate nigs, call 478-9425. Okay, well, yeah. uh, for a I've been a... Uh, turned into a Christian about an hour ago. Yeah. But now I'm a screw fan again. He offended me so much. <laughs> you have any Ramones? Um, not tonight. We just got we just got Blitzkrieg Bop. Uh, we'll be playing that Friday. And say hi to Kim for me. Hey Kim. Yo Kim, what's up? See ya. Yo. Yeah, I was wondering how you think the emo is gonna affect the music scene here in Austin. Hopefully, man, it'll be some competition. Yeah, you think it's gonna give a you know the Kelly Club run for its money there? I don't know, man. You think so? Yeah, I mean, uh, with, you know, free, if you're over 21, I think yeah. it's pretty good. You That's know, a pretty good deal. But, you know, Emo's, Emo's isn't going to be, like, concentrating on live music all the time, you know. Well, I mean, it's, I mean doesn't the Houston one kind of do that, though? Yeah. So what's Austin going to be like, the word you've heard? Uh, just, just what it says there. They're going to, you know, they're going to play dance tunes, you know, and uh, big hangout place. I guess good drinks or whatever, you know, good you place to hang out. Band or two? Yeah, obviously. I mean, tonight they uh, had Jesus Christ Superfly. Tomorrow they got Agony Column. Now, the word I've heard is they're going to have a Kilgoza reunion sometime. Have you heard anything about that? No way. That's what I've heard. I mean, I haven't heard word, a thing. The original word was that that's who's going to have the grand reopening for it, but I guess it's wow. been delayed or something. I guess so, yeah. Yeah. Well, man, that would be wild. Yeah, that's pretty Do you know, uh, Skate Nigs played uh, Damage 43, I believe it is, whatever the old uh, Big Boys tune last night. Yeah, I mean, Skate Nigs are okay, but. They, they don't do it for me too hard. That's terrible, man. I think they're great. Mm, I don't know. I think the Cop Shoot Cop Shoot will be pretty good Monday night. But, yeah, I was reading about that, man. Jelly Club, the 27th, yeah, Monday. Yeah, John Boy's going to be like the band opener, right? For one, that'd be pretty good to see. They're a yeah. little Austin band. But. Their political acuity is fine, but more interesting is how these New Yorkers incorporate samples, space, and noise into their two bass attack. Yeah. It's enough to make a grown up guitar yeah, band cry. Kind of wild stuff. Yeah. But, uh, you know, the Unsane Tuesday would be pretty good. Yeah, I guess so, man. I need to get hip to some of these new bands, man. I need to, that, that little number there, whatever it is, 473-3848. Man, any of you new bands out there, give me a call. I'd definitely love to have well, you on the show. You're doing a good job. Take it easy, man. Thanks a lot, dude. <coughs> Hello. Hello, how's it going? I'm doing well. How are you? Uh, I'm doing just fine. Beautiful. I just got something to say about that guy who called in the first time. Yeah. I don't really like uh, skating very much myself personally, but mm -hmm. you know that's not my own personal taste. But I think just to piss him off, you should play like either some Pain Teens or some Skinny Puppy or some uh, uh, Revco off of You Goddamn Son of a Bitch or something. Yeah, like right. That. I know. I understand, man. He does, doesn't understand. Well, I think he does understand freedom of speech. It's just he thinks that that contributes to the violence of society and such. I don't know. Even if it does, I mean, uh, no what way. what doesn't? I mean. Turn on Magnum P.I. or whatever. I don't watch TV too much. Whatever is hip today on TV, man. I mean, children see hundreds and hundreds and maybe thousands of, of murders before they turn 15, you know, on the TV. And it's like, uh, this is the least, least of their worries as it should be.
Yeah, right. You know, I mean, there's <laughs> the cartoons, man, the cartoons these days. I was up on a Saturday morning, man, and uh, flipped through the cartoons, and I was just like blown away. I had no idea that they were shooting and knifing and killing and clubbing people in cartoons on Saturday mornings. Uh, I mean, I, I remember Tom and Jerry and Bugs Bunny and stuff, man, and it's like, not like that anymore. Yeah. So there's, I mean, a Skate Nigs video with uh, whips and, and half-naked women should be the least of their worries. <laughs> Agreed. All I right. have one more question for sure, you. Sure, sure. Um, this is my first time to watch your show. I just was curious what time it was on. Well, um, this isn't what we usually do on Fridays. I just decided to show a bunch of this Skate Nigs stuff tonight um, because I wasn't even supposed to be on the air tonight. Uh, I had canceled this week's show because I was going to go film Omar and the Howlers, but it didn't work out. We're going to do that another time. So tonight I just came in with some heavy metal stuff and the stuff we filmed last night at the beautiful back room and uh, decided to play it. Usually what the deal is is on Friday nights from midnight to 4 on Channel 33, I roll uh, record company videos, you know, like touring bands and stuff. Um, we play like uh, anything from R.E.M. to Body Count to uh, Tribe Called Quest to Metallica. Uh, then Saturday nights from midnight to four on Channel 10, we play nothing but Texas music, and we interview bands live in the studio. Like tomorrow night, we're going to have three bands. Uh, midnight, we're going to interview Stretford. 1 a.m., we're going to interview uh, Fury, and 2 a.m., we're going to interview July Alley from Houston, I think. Uh, Tuesday nights, we have uh, from midnight to one on ACTV Channel 10, uh, a live band play in the studio live for an hour. Uh, this Tuesday is going to be December and then from 1 to 3 we do a combination of both shows. We call it like the freestyle thing and we play like you know a combination of all of my shows that I do. Okay. So um, that's basically it. We play a whole bunch of different kinds of music man so I mean there's probably not a you know 30 minutes of the show you you would watch without seeing uh, somebody you liked. Okay that's cool. All right. I'll see you later. All right thanks for calling. Hello. Hello, Dave. Yeah. Uh, this is John. Uh, I just want to make a comment about that video. Yeah. I normally don't listen to this kind of music, but it was pretty different. Yeah. And uh, I kind of enjoyed it. I just wanted to say. Cool. I uh, appreciate your input. Definitely, Great. Definitely. Thanks for taking the time to call in. Sure. See ya. Hello. Hi. 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 I haven't heard so many women lately. So, yeah, really. Um, it's been kind of slow on the women calling in tonight. Yeah, well, it takes a while to get in. It sure does. The women probably get frustrated. But I just want to say, I love skate nigs, and cool. the women are not, I mean, they, it's just a show, you know, they have whips, chains, all that kind of stuff, but it's more like they're in control than... You know, like they're being controlled, and right. so I don't really see anything wrong with them. That's true. And I mean, that that girl was beating people's ass up there, taking their pants off. Yeah, <laughs> throwing them back into the crowd. <laughs> she definitely. They're she's, they're really she's cool. Wild, yeah. Dude. Yeah, of course. And um, I just want to say that Sugar Shack's gonna be playing tomorrow night, Jelly Club. If anybody likes them. Sugar Shack, definitely. Yeah, they're cool. from Houston. Yeah. Yeah, they're really good. And um, also Ed Hall in Crest are gonna be Ed playing. Hall, man, they got they yeah, got that cool album. that cool new album with that kid poking the pencil through his mouth. Uh, yeah, it's awesome. I, I like. Them. Did you see him today at Waterloo? Uh, I missed it. No, but I saw a good write up. He's getting a lot of good press on that album. Or he, I say, there's they. not they. It's not an Ed Hall in the band. But, uh, <laughs> they they're getting a lot of good press. I saw some good reviews in some national magazines. That's so really cool. Yeah, I really like them a lot. But yeah, they've been around a while. Hopefully, they'll come play my show sometime. That would be really cool. I think they're really mm. kind of not not you know not that I don't like them, but they're kind of like jerks at least. One of them is, and so they're kind of hard to work with. <laughs> well, you know, I, I, I've worked with them all. Okay. Okay, well, thanks for watching. <laughs> okay, thanks a lot. Bye. Okay, bye bye. A female's viewpoint. What up? What up, man? Nothing. Hey, that guy that called up, was that um, Tipper Gore's son? Well, yeah, I think so. No, oh, okay, it sounds <laughs> like it. Yeah. All right. Um, are you, when are you guys going to play that uh, Dangerous Toys history thing again? I don't know, man. I'll tell you what, anybody who wants to see that Dangerous Toys. Uh, history of the dangerous toys call call uh, ACTV Monday and ask for programming tell them you want to see it uh, look the phone number up in the phone book it's there ACTV Austin Community Television uh, they'll play it for you or tell you when it's gonna play cool man the, what was the deal with that guy that called the dude that didn't like the video yeah I don't know man I mean he has his right to voice his opinion just as much as anyone else you know and I let him spew his spew I mean uh, I, you know I, I uh, I'm as much here for him as I am for the people who enjoyed it 
Oh, okay. I thought they sucked too, man. But, you know, I wouldn't call up and give you a sermon. Well, I mean, that's his right, you know. Yeah, I guess so, man. Cool. Well, whatever, dude. Thanks for your input. Uh, see ya. Take care. Take a few more phone calls, and I'm going to play that Corrosion of Conformity video, I promised you. What's up? Yo. Yo. Hey, Dave. This hey. is Al from Global Jungle. Hey, what's up, Al? Uh, not much. Uh, I was just curious. Hey, have you seen the uh, Mondo article? It's on the wall in there. Uh, vaguely, vaguely. Yeah, hey, well, uh, I was wondering, do you have Warlock lying around? Because uh, they mm. fucked us tonight. They didn't play our show. No way. No way, really. I mean, they lost our tape or something. Fucked up like that. I don't know. That's a drag. So, no, I mean, we've got, like, uh, ministry and, and butthole surfers in the, the skate nig stuff we filmed. Did you see any of that? I saw a little bit of the skate nig stuff, just, like, caught the tail end of it. We're, we're making a cake for a friend okay. for, for a birthday. And okay. so we're up, like, you know, we're late as hell, you know, trying to get all this shit done. So, yeah. Uh, what I like a drag the beard, by the way. Huh? like the beard, by the oh, way. Oh, yeah, yeah. I hadn't seen you in it. But hey, uh, anyway, if you've got uh, if you got Warlock lying around, like uh, read the little excerpt from the article about it, just to piss off a dude, for, or, or maybe explain it to him. You yeah, know, right. Just heard his little sermon, and you know. Pretty bizarre, huh? Yeah. Well, fuck him. I mean, uh, you know, we've had Mayor Todd calling up about our shit and everything like that. You know, it happens. <laughs> but you know, you can't explain this shit to people who aren't going to understand it. I know. Anyway. I know. Definitely. Just speak to your own, and don't worry about the unenlightened masses. I so, guess. So, so that guy, if he's still out there listening, tell him to watch your show. When does it come on? It's it's Fridays on ten. Fridays right? ten uh, midnight. At midnight, exactly. Uh, it, assuming that they don't lose the tapes. Right. Right. And uh, we're doing a new video, and uh, we'll uh, let you know when it's done. Cool. Get a copy to you. Yeah, I'd love to play it, man. You know, All right, well, we need need more ex inter exchanging like video productions between the producers here. I think would be really cool. Yeah, it's just you know we're, we're only there from like you know four to six in the morning. You and, and me both, man. I know yeah. what you mean, man. It's like you you guys got a little bit later shift than me, but I'm always here to like four and five in the morning. Right. But uh, that's that's where it's at. You got nobody in here to, to bother you. Yeah, no talking <laughs> head producers or anything. You know? <laughs> People with their dogs or whatever. Yeah. All right, well, uh, hey, man, take care and, okay. uh, and get Warlock in there if you got it around. Yeah, we didn't bring it tonight, man, but we got some pretty good metal stuff. We're waiting for the new Skinny Puppy video. I heard that's supposed to be pretty cool. You know, yeah, so. they're, they're supposed to be like late May, and it's going to be the killing game. Have you heard the album? No, I heard a bit of it. Inquisition, I think. Inquisition, that's brilliant. It's yeah. a great album, and just listen to it high with headphones and blinders. <laughs> that's the ticket, dude. All right, man, well, you have fun. All right, man, take All care. Right. See ya. Maybe, maybe they'll play your show twice. Hey. Yeah. Hey, what's going on, man? I'll uh, just answer in the funky line. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> um, hey, listen, uh, two things to say. Number yeah. one, fucking Billy Goat is badass. Dude. Did you go see him tonight? Oh, man, they tore it up. Dude, I bet they did. I wish I could have been there, man. It was awesome. And also, the second thing, the new Beastie Boys kicks ass. Dude. Check your head. Pass yeah. the mic, dude. Oh, man, it's badass. That's great. Hey, man, next Friday... Uh -huh. uh, on Raw Time, we're going to have some Beastie Boy posters to give away if you're into that. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, they're pretty neat. That sounds cool. Cool. Yeah. All well, right, listen, man. man. I'm going to pass the phone here to my bud. Hold on. Yo. Billy Goat, man. Our hey, good what's band. Going on, dude? Yo, what's up? Hey, that guy that called and said all oh, that crap about the skate nigs. Yeah. I went to the, to the video shoot mm -hmm. earlier this year for the skate nigs. I was wondering what's going to happen with that. Is that I've it? got it. You do? Yeah, you want to see it? Yeah, sure. totally. I'll, I'll, I'm going to play Corrosion of Conformity next, and then we'll play that. Yeah, hey, if that guy's out there that's still listening, I want to tell him he can suck my fucking dick. Super chunk, man, super chunk. Yeah. All right, man. Well, uh, thanks for calling, man. And, uh, man, thanks for going to check out the local music, man. Billy Goat uh, from Dallas, I think, or Houston or something here in Texas. It's where it's at. Uh, a lot of good calls on Billy Goat. I guess we're going to, you know, hold off for a minute. All y'all uh, call me up with your comments uh, if you still would like to talk about the Skate Nig stuff. Uh, we will be playing a little more of that show for all you folks who enjoyed it, and we'll even be playing uh, some more of that show for you people who didn't enjoy it.
man, write, write all your favorite record companies and tell them to quit censoring stuff, man. It's not where it's at. Um, also, write MTV and tell them they suck because they uh, have exclusives on videos and they play them so many times that uh, by the time us lowly video programmers get them, you don't want to see them anymore. Like, uh, do you want to see Guns N' Roses a million times? Do you want to see Nirvana come as you are? No, you don't. But, uh, or maybe you do, but I know I don't. Howdy, what's up? Hey, dude, I want to say hi to that Scott guy from Shoal Creek. Man. Oh, cool, so we got the Shoal Creek people in yeah, effect I mean, tonight, the man. the insane member of the Murray Bicycle Band here. Oh, no way. Yeah. Cool, man. But we haven't been playing for a little bit, but uh, Obviously. We'll, we'll be on there a little bit. So. Well, that would be good, huh? Yeah. Cool, cool. All right, man. Uh, you got to bring some. You don't have Holy Wars, do you, man? Uh, sure don't, man. You got Hangar 18, right? Yeah. You bring that? Nah, no Megadeth tonight. I saw not that. Not next week, man. Uh, call me and remind me at my little number there, 473-3848, and I'll try to make right. a point of it. All right, man. How about Wake Up Day? You bring that one? Uh, you remind me, I sure will. When do you want me to call later? Right? Uh, just any time. Leave me a message. You know, I'll check them later tonight. All right, man. Thanks. All right. I'll, pl I'll be playing soon on your, on your show. Here. Please do, man. All right, man. Okay, thanks All for right. watching. See you. See ya. Hello. 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 Hey, yeah, I'm. Excuse I'm me, I'm watching your show for the first time. Great, man. And, uh, I heard that guy call up, yeah, uh, bitching you out or whatever. Right. And uh, I have to say, in a couple of ways, I kind of agree with them. I don't know if it's right to call and chew you out like that. No, man, please do. I mean, anything you want to say, please but, say it. I mean, I, I just don't see what's so cool about seeing some guy. I mean, like jerk off up there. I mean, I, you know, all the moss and stuff. That's all. You know, I can see how people get into that, but it just seemed like kind of went a little bit far, don't you think? Mm, I don't, but I mean, what I think really doesn't matter. Well, what was so cool about it? I don't know. I just I didn't. I didn't say it was. You know, I'm just playing it. You make your decision. I see. Well, it seemed like some of the callers thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, and I mean, that's they're right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I just don't see what's so cool about seeing some guy jerk off on stage. Yeah, well, that's that's your opinion, man. Totally, I and I respect you for it. I mean, you have every right to voice it. Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks for taking the time to call. Sure. Take care. Hello. 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 Yeah, this is Kim's roommate. Hey, what's up? Hey, not much, man. I'm taking the show for her tonight. Oh, cool, man. Maybe she can see some of it, huh? Oh, yeah. She's all freaked out about being a star. She was recognized twice, and <laughs> so she's all, you know, excited well, about it. We're going we're gonna to play some more here in a little while. Cool. Could you cut it off at just the part where she was undoing my pants? So <laughs> I'm dying to see more, you know? Dying to see more, huh? Yeah. So what do you think about all the, all the flack people been giving well, you? Well, I'd like to say to that one guy who said it takes no talent. Yeah, right? Yeah, I mean... She, like, works out every single day, eats like the total health food queen, you know. She's been dancing for two years now. Yeah, man. I, I mean, mean, those people put a lot you into it. You're sore the next day. Yeah, I know. I saw her after the show. She was like, people were trying to, you know, hey, great, that looked great. She's like, don't touch me. Yeah, you know? leather ain't cheap either. Yeah, right? Yeah. Leather is expensive, and not to mention the uh, cuffs that go along and things like that. Exactly. Yeah, man. Well, thanks, and uh, we'll be playing some more. All right, man. Take All right. Care. Thanks for calling. Hello. Hey, how's it going? Doing well. How are you? All right. Hey, I just wanted to call and tell you, man, you're doing a great job. I appreciate it, man. I I'm I'm didn't offend you. I didn't offend you. No. All right, man. I'm from out in uh, West Texas. Ah, doing, doing, about a month ago. doing the West Texas waltz, huh? Yeah, up in Lubbock. Uh, I know a lot of uh, cool people from Lubbock, man. Butch Hancock, Joe Ely, Jimmy Dale Gilmore, man, yeah. the Flatlander <laughs> well, crew. Man, I was wondering, all these all these uh, awesome bands that you play, is there uh, is there places where you can buy tapes or, or you know, yeah. stuff like that? Yeah, man. Um, there's a couple places that come to mind immediately. Uh, Sound Exchange, a uh, real cool place down on the drag on Guadalupe. All right. Um, Tower Records on... Now, I'm not sure about Tower. they probably got a real small local section, but I know they probably carry a few local ones. Um, your Sound Warehouses have a whole section dedicated to Texas music. All right. Um, Inner Sanctum. Uh, real independent place. They don't believe in CDs. They just have tapes and albums. A uh, good place to check. You know, a lot of most of these uh, record, you know, stores here in town are pretty hip to the Austin scene, which is really really cool. You yeah, know, well, though. I've been making some tapes off my off my stereo, sending them back to friends back at uh, Texas Tech. Well, man, tape, feel free to tape my shows. I mean, if I you mean, see, they, they they love it. Cool, down, man. Down, down there, you can't get away with stuff like that. I mean, yeah. You know how it is down in West Texas. Have you have you seen any of the videos we played and stuff? Ah, uh, I've been record. I recorded the skate mix and I'm sending it down to a bunch of uh, friends down. Great, the great man. I mean, yeah. spread it around, dude. And uh, but 
Yeah, just keep up the good job, man. Thanks a lot. Yeah, take it easy. Take care. Hello. 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 Hi. Hey. Uh, where'd that stock that uh that dude named Scott go? Uh, I don't know, man. He's over at Shoal Creek, I guess. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hey, when y'all gonna play some more Steve Ray Vaughn? Um, probably maybe maybe tomorrow night on Capsize between midnight and four on Channel Ten. We'll definitely play some. All right, who are those dudes? Uh, I think last last weekend they were on Channel Ten, and they had all that uh, sex toy bullshit. That was us. That was y'all. Yeah. You had something to do with that? Yeah, sure did. Damn, man, that was some crazy shit. Hell yeah, it was, man. <laughs> all but, right then, Dave. Later. Okay, man. Take care. Hello. 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 What's up? Man, hanging out, fixing to play that loudspeaker video from Skate Nigs. From Skate Nigs? Yeah, oh, the cool, one man. they shot at the back room, man. Yeah, it sounds real good, man. It's yeah, cool. definitely. <laughs> Kim's in there uh, whipping more people. Hey, I wanted to ask you a question, though. Um, uh -huh. Do you know Matt James by any chance? He used to play Matt drums James. for Onyx. Yeah, sure do. Yeah, they supposedly kicked him out because of bad attitude or something yeah, like that. Yeah, or whatever, yeah. Yeah, do you know by any chance what happened to him? I used to work with him a while back. No, man, not last time I talked to him, he was really looking hard for a band, man. He was He's a great drummer. I hope he finds something, yeah, man. Yeah, he's real good. I was just wondering. I hadn't heard from him in forever. That's yeah, I haven't either, him. man. I don't know what's up with uh, him. I heard that uh, the other two people in Onyx's band were doing something pretty cool, and uh, Onyx is definitely getting something together that's hot. Yeah. Um, but man, I haven't heard from Matt in a while. He used to call me up on the shows all the time. Hmm. But uh, hopefully he's doing something hip. I'm sure he is. Yeah, well, hopefully so. Yeah, really. You by any chance have a death video with you tonight? Yeah, I do. You think you could play it? Shh, why not? Okay, man, thanks a lot. Okay. See ya. See ya. Take three more calls and uh, I'm going to play the skate yeah, music. Yeah. Okay, cool. Hey, uh, the Chronicle's a little bit old now, isn't it? But besides that. This, what do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, well, just. It's, Kind of lame now. Nah, they're, they're still pretty hip, man. I mean, they tell you what's going on. Yeah, they're close. I mean, there's a yeah, lot of close. You're right. a lot of stuff between here and here and there, yeah. that, that, that <laughs> don't, yeah, right, you know, yeah. I don't read it all, but uh, I'd say from the last quarter of the magazine. Like five pages is, are pretty cool. The, the last quarter of the magazine right, is my yeah. favorite. Yeah, I agree. Uh, that band, that, you know, you're fixing the show again? Yeah. Tell me, hey, remember Adrian Ballou and Robert Fripp? Mm-hmm. Okay, and the Tubes, the first band yeah, ever right. playing Austin that was R-rated. Yeah, right. 21 and over at the Armadillo. That was crazy, man. It was great. Mr. LSD. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it was a cool show, man. Yeah, man. Great. The Tubes, man. So, That's I mean, they have no problem. I mean, these people that are calling in, either they've been asleep for 20 years or... <laughs> Need to be asleep or, for 20 yeah. years. <laughs> Maybe for 20, another 20 years and then they'll be happy. Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay, man. Good show. Okay. You're doing good, man. Thanks for taking the time to call, man. Yeah, take, take a while. <laughs> take care. Yeah, I'll bet. See ya. Hello. Hey, que paso? Que paso, man? What's up? Yo. Hey, you know a lot of bands, eh? Uh, Austin? Kinda, yeah. Hey, you, you, you've heard of Jigsaw, right? Yeah. Hey, what's your drummer's name, you know? Only one I know in Jigsaw is Rob. Rob. I think he's singing or guitar, and I think he's singing. Man, I was just wondering. They're supposed to be badass, man. Hey, you, you ever film them? Not yet, man. We were trying to set something up for the 7th, and I don't know what's up. The equipment's not supposed to be back till 8 o'clock at night, and it's like I'm supposed to set it up at like 4 or 5, so I don't know if we're going to be able to swing it or not. I have to talk to the wonderful Dean Langston, who's got that stuff that day, and see if we can get it any earlier, you know? Yeah, well, you know where they're going to be playing out here around town, any? They're playing May 7th at the back room. At the back room. Yeah, that's uh, Thursday, May 7th, I think. I think they're playing May 7th, man. Let me check. I, I didn't see it listed in here. I, I was just wondering about their drummer. I think I know the guy. Everybody's really? Been telling me there's is it, if I knew his name, would you know him? No. I, the, like I said, the only one I've ever met was was, uh, was Rob. and I, It's not listed here yet, but I believe they're playing May 7th. So uh, check it out at the back room. It should well, be hey, way cool. If anybody out there is listening, they know the drummer's name, call in. Let yeah, know. usually those guys are watching, man. So, hey, and I'll tell you what. Uh, some good friends of theirs, Fury, yeah. a band called Fury. They're going to be on Capsize tomorrow night. All right. And uh, they'll be able to tell you for sure what the guy's name is if you want to tune in. They'll be on at uh, 1 a.m., I believe Fury's going to be on. All right, man. Well, take it easy. You got it. Yeah. See ya. <coughs> Last call before we play the Skate Nigs loudspeaker video. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I was wondering uh, how many dicks you could fit in your mouth. 
I haven't really tried, man, but um, man, if you give me some tips on how to do it, man, maybe maybe we could get you up here to give us a experimental video kind of thing, and we'll we'll learn about that, man. Um, this is a video shot at the beautiful back room before they got their lights and stuff, but it still looks really damn cool. Um, the stuff I shot at the skate nigs last night, it's got all the cool new Intelli beams and stuff from the back room, and uh, man, you can't beat it. It's the best best place to shoot video in town. Who's on the um, phone? Am I on TV yet? Yeah, who was who answering your phone, man? Hello? Yeah, it's hey, you. Hey, 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 you know, I just saw Billy Goat. Yeah. You know how badass they were? Yeah, I don't. I wish I, I, wish I did know. You should have gone, man. It was so fucking badass. Flavor Flay was fucking stage diving and shit. What now? Flavor Flay. Flavor Flay? He stopped in with Ice-T. You know, body count? Oh, yeah. They hooked up there tonight. No. I mean, for a second, no, no big deal, shit. Wow. Hey, man, play that one Oak Town 357. Yeah. You know, with the, with the titties, man. Well, check out May 8th, uh, 1 to 2 a.m. I think you'll see some stuff you like. Okay? All right, man. Hey, I got a friend here who wants to talk to you, man. All right, man. I ain't going to lie to you, guys, baby. <laughs> no. Thank you. Next time, take the phone uh, out of your mouth. Yeah, I was wondering uh, how many times you fucked me up. <laughs> <laughs>
Was that funny? I didn't think that was funny. I don't know. Some people, they don't think very hard when they want to insult me, man. If you get a little original, that's really cool. Yeah, what's up? Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, it's a pretty cool show. Thanks, I appreciate it. Yeah, well, we do the show on uh, KTSB, like a uh, grunge rock type of thing. Cool. Well, when are you on? Uh, Monday nights, uh, 11 o'clock to 1 o'clock, Tuesday morning, whatever. Yeah, yeah. It's called the Red and Rosie Show, named after this uh, drag racing type underground slick thing. Cool, man. Uh, I, KTSB yeah, I is super hip, man. I used like steel pole bathtub. And yeah. Stuff like that. Yeah, we play stuff like that. Bong water. Bong water. Yeah, yeah. that's, that's kind of light, but. Uh, yeah, it is. It's more well, alternative. We like bong water lines. It, it, pussy, you know. Yeah, right. They're good. Oh, yeah, man. but hey, uh, you know, as far as this skate mix thing, I guess it's not even worth talking about. I know what you mean, right? <laughs> it's pretty freaky what people think, man. But uh. But hey, like play some. Uh, have you seen a new Soundgarden video for like uh, Rusty, Cage? Rusty Cage? Yeah, yeah, man. Tuesday night after the Soundgarden show on uh, Channel 10, we're going to be playing like a whole bunch of Soundgarden videos and Pearl Jam and Swerve Driver. Cool, yeah, Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, cool we're going to play that. We're going to play uh, Loud Love, Hands All Over. We're going to play a bunch of cool stuff. All right, man, well, cool show. Maybe All right, we'll man. Well, K KTSB is definitely where it's at, man. Maybe I'll uh, give you a call up there and uh, harass you on the radio or something. <laughs> All right, man. All right, man. I used Ready? to do. I used to help do the metal show up there, man. Oh, really? Yeah, Ray Segrin got me into that, man. He's fucking definitely hip. Definitely hip. Okay. All right, man. Later. See ya. <coughs> Yo. Yo, do you listen to Homie on KTSB 11 to 1 or what, man? KTSB is where it's at. <laughs> yeah, you. Howdy. Not the I can spell. I know what that is. Oh, hey. <laughs> What's up, dude? You knocked the B-O-N-G oh, over, dude. Oh, just knocked the bong over, man. Oh, that's terrible, man. Oh, that sucks. What are you doing? Well, maybe I shouldn't ask. Yeah, we're just... Uh, we're, we're just Chill. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah, gonna, what videos y'all play next? They're gonna play some fucking uh, thrash. We're gonna play death next, dude. Death. Death. Lack of comprehension. Right. Yeah, have you ever seen Spiritual it? Spiritual metal. <laughs> yeah, right. Death. This death video is kind of like a little mini movie. Hey, dude. Y'all are partying and shit, huh? Man, y'all are partying too hard. Guys, man. What? Take your beauty. Yeah, I am. Howdy. Hey, how's it going? I'm doing well. How are you? Hey, how many more girls are we going to have to kill before you play our video? <laughs> what video, man? Warthog 2001, UK. Oh, man. Pedophile. Come down here and play for us. We'll be play it every week, man. Okay, we'll bring it in. We'll bring do, it in. Do, do you Crime see the, stoppers and all that stuff. the little right? number there? 1-800-CRIME-92, Warthog 2001, Yogurt Murders. Yo, 473-3848, dude. Give me a call. Hello? Yeah. What's up? Listening to the somebody in the background talking about the fucking keg and yeah yeah yeah. <laughs> well, you guys playing videos tonight? Yeah, we're gonna play Death next. Death? Yeah. All right, man. And then we're gonna play some more of the skate nigs. You Who? Harlot? You guys got Harlot? No, we don't have any Harlot hey, that's, yet, that's, man. That's um, tomorrow night, isn't it? Yeah, tomorrow. but we don't. But we don't have any Harlot yet, man. I don't know what's up with Danger those guys. Toys? Um, yeah, we might play some toys tomorrow. That's pretty cool. Badass band, man. They're working on a new album yeah, right I've now. Yeah, I've seen the the little thing you guys got going on on them. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Yeah, they're they're working on a new album right now. They just got through playing in Hawaii, man. Um, besides Salacious Acres, or yeah, the, the new one, the, whatever it's called, man. They're, Not they're, too good album, but. Yeah, well, they're working on a brand new one. They've written written some songs with Randy Bachman from BTO, and they're writing with a bunch of other people that are really cool, uh, getting together all new songs, man. And they're going to come out with a stomping album. That's kick ass. Definitely. Um, where can you get those cap size shirts from? Um, Sound Warehouse, Ben White and Lamar. Okay. All right. Can you play any Pantera tonight? Uh, tomorrow we're going to definitely play Mouth for War. I didn't bring it tonight. Okay. Well, what can you play? We're going to play Death. We're going to play some more Skate Nigs. We're going to play Butthole Surfers, Ministry, Course of Empire. CLC? You, you missed it, man. We just got through playing CLC. Oh, really? Vote with a bullet. <laughs> Sex pistols? No, I don't have any, man. I wish I did. I got some Public Image Limited. How about public, enemy? Public, public Enemy? Public Enemy. How about next Friday? 
Okay, man. Okay, Look, man. I can take it easy. I'll take it any way it comes, man. Later. See ya. Hello. Hey, you got any uh, videos by uh, Agony Column or Dead Horse? Uh, not tonight, but man, we'll play all that stuff on Saturday nights, man. Tune in tomorrow after midnight on Channel 10. All right, dude. We'll play both of them, Agony Column and Dead Horse. Cool. Okay. You know Dead Horse is playing Thursday? Are you still there? Yeah, where are they playing? Uh, they're playing at the back room Thursday with Entombed and uh, Exhorter. All right. It's going to be a stomping show, man. Don't miss it. All right, thanks. Okay. Hey, hello. Hey, what's up, dude? Hanging out, man. Do well, it. man, I just wanted to tell you all that I really liked your show, and I've been watching it for a few weeks now. Cool. And it's really great. You know, I think the spirit of uh, Access TV and shit, you know, is really like free speech at its mm -hmm. finest. You know, we got to take over the airwaves. And yeah. Shit. You know, you can't just let the the you know corporations you know the alternative to the alternative exactly man that's definitely and, where it's at man man i also wanted to say that i was at the show last night skate next show and rolling dude I was, man i was digging on y'all shoot man that did you did you see any very nice footage did man. you see yourself in there anywhere no no i was towards the back but ah. man grooving on the lights and everything we're gonna play some more here in a while well man it's definitely i also wanted to say you know uh you know, some girl called in earlier and was talking about Sugar Shack, and people have been talking about Billy Gunn and stuff. Yeah. And, man, there's a lot of really cool Texas bands, you know, and they've had a really hard... I mean, like, no rock stations will play that shit. Not at all. And Access TV and, like, KTSB and, like, totally student radio and, like, Access Television and stuff, you know, it's like... That's where it's know, at. I mean, man, that's where... You know, that's the only places that, you know, that will really give them any airplay, you know. And yeah. And that, you have to just go out there and find it for yourself. But it's out there, man. And yeah. I urge people to go out and support, you know, the local bands and local scene as much as you can. That's with very whatever true. Whatever kind of music you get into, you know. Whatever it is, man. I read off a bunch of shit in here earlier tonight, man. I mean, there's just everything that you want, man. Anywhere you want to go in town, Steamboat, The Back Room, Continental Club, 311, Main Event, man. Uh, all of these places, Saxon Pub, Emos is doing stuff now, man. Cavity. Yeah, the Cavity, Sanitarium, man, all of these cool places. Uh, it just can't be beat. Austin definitely rules. The Jelly Club, man. Jelly Club is definitely one of the places that has a, one of the widest varieties of music, and that's very hip. Oh, definitely. I mean, well, and, you know. And your show, too, you know, I think it's great that y'all, you know, play, you know, metal shit and hardcore and then, like, rap. Yeah, like man. All kinds of stuff, you know, because it's like people say alternative or, you know, mainstream rock or metal or whatever, you know, and it's just labels. It's all bullshit. There's, know, no, music music and there's no time for just listening to one kind of music, man. You're wasting, you're wasting your ears if you just listen to one kind of music. No shit, man. Well, That's for man, sure. y'all are doing a great job. And, Thanks. And keep up the good work, man. All right, man. Thanks for calling, Thanks. dude. Bye. Take care. Hello. Hey, what up? All hanging out, man. Hey, didn't earlier in the show you say that uh, Jason was going to be on? Or you talked to him or something? Yeah, we talked on the phone earlier. We were rapping and stuff. <laughs> I, I, was, I was making a joke. Someone asked for Jason, and I said, no, he's not here right now, man. No, oh, okay. What did he have to say? Who, Jason? Yeah. Uh, they, just got, they just flew in from Hawaii. They just got through playing a gig out in Hawaii. Um, went really well. They headlined and uh, played like four new tunes. And... Uh, they're writing some stuff, fixing to go in with a producer and work on some more demos and uh, trying to get some all new songs together for a stomping new album, man. Are they going to be in town anytime soon, you know? No, they're not going to be playing live anytime soon, man, because they're working so hard on writing. But they're hanging out, you know, and we're, we're playing that uh, video on the channel from time to time, so, I mean, you can at least see the videos and stuff. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I haven't seen that yet. Yeah, well, man, call up programming at ACTV Monday and say, hey, yeah. programming. We want to see that Dangerous okay. Toys thing. Okay. All right. Um, I guess that's it, man. Okay, well, thanks for taking the time to call, man. See you. See ya. Hello. Hey, Dave. Yeah. You ever had your picture on an album cover? Uh, no, nah, not recently. Uh, uh, that's, that's the key, recently. Cause I got a Leonard Skinner album, man, and I swear it's you. I'm standing in the flames, dude. Well, I see. I got the the first one. I think it's her first album. Uh huh. Has her pronunciation key underneath her name, and it's yeah, pronounced Leonard Skinner. There you go. Yeah. And uh, it's you on the far right, man. Me and Artemis Pyle, man, we're like that. <laughs> Take it easy. See ya. Three more calls, and we're gonna play that uh, darn death video. What's up? Hey, Dave. Yo. What are you doing? Man, hanging, fixing to play death. Lack of comprehension. Huh. Uh, what kind of videos are you gonna play in the mm. next hour? 
metal uh, grunge good. stuff. Good stuff. Okay. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Ciao. Bye. Uh, someone here, I don't think is too hip to it. Uh, can you see the big picture? Uh, not exactly. Please tell me why. Oh, why? Uh, I just uh, don't appreciate someone telling me I'm ignorant and dumb. Do you think that it was directed at you, though? No, I just don't like their music. Yeah, okay. I mean, that's, that's entirely your, your, your opinion and prerogative. That's for sure. I mean, the skate. That I mean, they should keep their day job for sure. <laughs> well, they they got a record deal, you know. Oh, they, well, that's good for them. That'd yeah. Probably be their only one. <laughs> well, I tell you what, I've had about a hundred phone calls up here tonight that like it. Oh well. I mean, but everyone's I mean, got I, an opinion. Yeah, I, and I totally respect yours, and thank I you. I want to give you the I time to say so. I appreciate that. Definitely. Thank you. Thank thank you for taking the time to call. Hello. It's you. You were on hold, too. Hello. Hello. Yeah, hi. Hello? Yeah. You talking to me? Uh-huh. <laughs> I talked to you earlier? Yeah. What's up, man? Hanging out, man. What are you doing? Ah, just kind of chilling, sitting back, drinking a little beer, watching some flick on HBO. It kind of sucks. Oh, well, you got to be watching this channel, man. Uh, I hear you. I hear you. Hey, uh, like I told you earlier, I just wanted to give kind of like a little testimonial about uh, EMS. Yeah, definitely, man. Play this guy went... Fucking rocks. Cool, man. Yeah. He went to Emo's tonight and yeah. saw the grand opening, man. Yeah, Tell I'm us from about it. I'm from Houston, and there's uh, Emo's in Houston. I mean, that's why you're in Houston. We've got Emo's, man. The place just, is just happening, man. Is, is the one here in Austin anything like the one in Houston? Yeah, it's exactly. Much better? <laughs> Much better? Yeah. Much better. That's Rock and saying. roll. Um, yeah, well, it's just like um, in Emo, I mean, it's the same atmosphere. I mean, in both in Houston and Austin, same yeah. kind of people. It's a really cool crowd. Everybody's kind of laid back, sitting back, you know, drinking a little brisky, drinking a little shots, whatever. Yeah. And uh, there was a pretty good little band there tonight. Matter of fact, I don't know the name of the band that was there tonight, but it was really good. Well, let me see, man. I had it here. We were we were reading about it earlier, man, because um, definitely emos, man. Any place that's starting up a new deal is definitely hip. Uh, Jesus Christ Superfly or Trouser Trout? Uh, I think Jesus Christ. That they they're badass, man. The old guys used to be in EMG and stuff, but they're. It definitely happened, man. Jesus Christ Superfly is supposed to be the, the hip thing. So, um, the skate they don't, they don't have a, a label yet? Yeah, man. They're on Mega Force Worldwide. Oh, really? Yeah. Damn. That's what I thought that you didn't play any music that, uh, if like, somebody had a label, you didn't play their music. No, that's to, on Friday nights, we play nothing but labels, bands. Uh -huh. Saturday nights, we play unsigned bands. All right. So, what, so what kind of music you run? Are you, how long are you going to be on? Uh, we're only going to be on another 25 minutes tonight. So you got all your requests in there? Yeah, yeah. We're going to play Ministry next, and uh, then I think we'll probably play a little more uh, Skate Nigs. Ah. Unless you don't want to see any more people, let me know. <laughs> what about that? What about that P.E.? The P.E.? Yeah. I didn't bring none tonight, man. We'll be doing P.E. Friday, though, definitely. You got any, uh, any hip-hop at all? Uh, not tonight, man. Really? Yeah, we decided to bring in mostly grunge and metal tonight, but next Friday, man, I promise we'll play some of the cool hip-hop. 
Hey, L7, yes, we just got the brand new L7 video. L7 good, huh? Yeah, man, we, we're going to play that uh, next Friday, I think. Maybe even Saturday, uh, tomorrow night on Capsize, if I can remember to bring it. Sure if, any, if you people want to see L7's new video tomorrow night, call my little bitty, wait, it's over here, little right. bitty number, 473-3848, and remind me, and I'll bring it. Sure, and I, is that the new album? Yeah, off the new album. Sure. Uh, well, I just heard somebody talking about, uh, well, I heard you talking about emos earlier, so I just yeah. wanted to call in and say Thanks. it's a fucking rocking place. Thanks, man. Everybody's been hanging out there, just chill. Go see Agony Call him tomorrow night. And Eric's, Eric's doing a hell of a job. Cool. He's the, he's the editor of that place, man. He's just, he's chilled. Well, I definitely want to get in touch with those people, man. Maybe we can work together, you know? All right. We'll tell That'd them a little Okay. Later. See ya. Okay. Yeah? Hey. 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 What's up, dude? Hanging out, man. Hey, man. What do you want to listen to, man? I want to listen to uh, that darn ministry ding dang ding a dong ding dong video. Oh, hell, man. That sounds good. I'm getting sick of hearing what everybody else wants to listen to. What do you want to listen to? <laughs> I'd rather listen to Madonna and Debbie Gibson. No, but, uh, no. Get see, the that's, hell out of here. See, that's why I play what you people want to hear. Hey, no, 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 man. I like the first runoff you did or a ministry and shit. Yeah. Hey, no. That's our yep. next video. You got it. You got it. Suicidal, something like that? No, nah, we didn't bring any tonight, man. All right, you got the ministry stuff, though, huh? The next. All right, you going to cook it? You know it. All right, buddy. We're cooking uh, with gas, dude. All right, thanks, man. <laughs> See ya. Uh, later. Hello. Dave. Yeah. Hey, what's up? Man, hanging out, fixing to oh. play some ministry, dude. Oh, dude, I went to the concert last night. Cool, man. It's bad. I went backstage. Did you see the video? Yeah, I did. What'd you think? It was all right. Cool. Zip, zip, bye. Right? I don't know. I couldn't all hear right. Talk to you later. See ya. Bye-bye. Hey, hello. Hey, man. What happened to the guar? Uh, okay. We'll play it. Tonight? Yep. Cool. Thanks. All right. Bye. See ya. <coughs> hello. Hey, what's up, man? Man, fix and play ministry, dude. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Hey, yo, man. I just want to let everybody know that retarded elf going to be at the sanitarium, sanitarium. mañana. Tomorrow? Tomorrow night, man. Man, what's this shit here in, in this damn piece of paper, oh, man? That's fucked up, man. It's man. all wrong. Oh, yeah, boy. man. What the you hell? You know what I'm talking about? Look at I this, man. It's going to be mañana. Tomorrow. It's not March 28th. No. It's, it's tomorrow. Yeah, the 26th. At the, at the sanitarium yeah. with El Flaco. That's verdad. Retarded Elf, man. Yo, money. You know what I'm talking about. Shit. Dope, dude. All right. Shit we'll is dope, you tomorrow. man. I, I'd love to be there, but I got to do this TV thing. But man, y'all kick it live. I'm gonna come see you guys soon. Hey, well, smoke one for us, homeboy. I'll try. Ole. <laughs> Ole vato. Hello. Hey, what's going on? Oh man, fixing to roll some video after your call. Oh, yeah. Man. Yeah. That's cool. Cool. Yo, fuck. Thank you. What are you watching for? I don't fucking know. Well, change the channel, hang up the phone, and uh, go to bed, dude. It's up past your bedtime, man.
more phone lines tonight and then go back to uh, some, some skate nigs. Are you there? Guess not. Are you there? Hello. Hello. Hey, Cookie. Hey. <laughs> What's up? Hey, Cookie. That ain't me. It is you. What's up? You look good. You look good. Straight hair. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. Is that all you need? Uh-uh. Okay. Hello. Hanging out, man. Fixing to close out the show, dude. I cannot wait for Gore to get here. Oh, man, you ain't lying. That's going to be a hot show. It's been a while. It's been too long. Outside. I wish I could tell them that. <laughs> cool, man. Yeah, you know. That's how it goes. Anyway, just let me call and say hey. All right, man. Sounds good. Thanks for watching, as usual. All right. He, does he blow? No, dude, personally, I think he's got a really cool voice. I don't know. I don't even know the guy. I never heard him. Uh, well, I, I'm good friends with him, and I'm pretty proud of him. Well, tell him we love him. All right. All right, man. Thanks for watching. You know, I met a girl at the uh, Skate Nicks party last night that said she was Walt. I don't know what's up. Hi. Yo, man. Yo. I want you to do something for me. What do you want me to do, man? Yeah, look up. Okay. Look down. Uh-huh. Oh, no, man, you're not doing it. I'm watching you. Terrible. I don't play no homie games. What's up? Hello? Hello? Dude, it's you, man. Dude, it's you. It's you, man. It's you. Dude, you're not. No way. There's a lot of gays in It's you, man. And a lot of alternatives. See ya. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, um, I want to know something about ministry. Okay. Oh, I heard a rumor. Yeah. That they were gay. Uh, I don't know, man. That's that's an old rumor, dude. You need to catch up, man. They're they're moving on to bigger and better things now, man. They're putting it past the butt, man. You need to learn. Austin, Texas, man. Thanks for tuning in. It's been real. I had a good time. Thanks for sitting in for the ride. Tomorrow night, capsize, 12 to 4 a.m. At midnight, we have an interview with Stretford. Uh, at 1, we have an interview with Fury. At 2, we have an interview with July Alley. And then we're going to have fun for the rest of the night. Uh, if you got any videos you didn't see tonight, call 473-3848, and I'll bring them along. Um, thanks for all your input. Uh, tune in next Tuesday night, Night of Soundgarden. December is going to play live in the studio from 12 to 1. And 1 to 3, we're going to play a bunch of Pearl Jam, Soundgarden, Swerve Driver, all sorts of stuff. Take your calls, your comments on the show. Uh, make sure to go out to the, uh, your choice of venues tomorrow night. Plenty of good shows. Agony Column at Emo's, Joe Rockhead at Steamboat, uh, Widespread Panic at the Back Room, uh, man, Two Nice Girls at Liberty Lunch, uh, a million things going on tomorrow night. Definitely go do something. Uh, everybody, thanks for calling. Thanks for being a part of the show.